And now, from the Forewarn Weather Center, Chief Meteorologist David Paul. Our temperature is running a little hotter than normal, and that will continue through midweek and then easing a bit by late week as we have rain chances in sight. So some good news. I think many of us could use some rainfall today. It's been hot and it's been dry. 96 now in Dothan, 96 in Geneva and Mariana, 98 in Crestview and Troy, 94 in Ozark, but it's not real humid. The dew point temperature generally in the middle 60s, and that is some relief as we go through through tomorrow, dew points climbing back into the 70s. That really muggy air comes back in, but a pocket of drier air across parts of the southeast kind of oozing southward, making it feel a bit better outside. And that's why low temperatures have been in the lower 70s. Again tonight, lower 70s for lows. We are dry, no rain on the Doppler radar here. Plenty of activity well east of us, parts of Georgia and South Carolina into the uh, eastern part of Florida, more or less. As we go northward, we have some high clouds here, Tennessee into Alabama. These are drifting southward. Should make for some good colors in the sky at sunset, kind of filtering that super moon rising this evening. But a very quiet pattern, at least for the short term. Temperatures overnight will be in the middle to lower 70s tomorrow morning. As we go through tomorrow, some passing high clouds. Temperatures hitting the middle 90s. A slight chance of a stray p.m. shower. The coverage very limited tomorrow. A little more moisture coming in tomorrow and for tomorrow night. So not as cool heading into Thursday. Low temps, middle 70s, and then for our Thursday, hot and humid again with a better chance for some isolated pop up showers and storms. Not real widespread on Thursday. I dropped that rain chance to 30%, but the coverage does look to go up for Friday and for the first part of the weekend. Unfortunately, Saturday again, your tropical update. No worries. Close to home, the Gulf of Mexico, nice and quiet as is the Caribbean and really most of the Atlantic. No areas of concern out there. This is a weak area of low pressure. The opportunity to organize is really closing out there in the far eastern part of the Atlantic. A couple tropical waves, but no signs really of any decent organization over the next several days, which is good as we head through the first part of August. At the coast tomorrow, Good beach weather, good boating weather, yellow flags, winds pretty light at about five knots, seas offshore, one foot or less, a light chop on coastal lakes and bays, water temperature, it's way up there holding at 87 degrees. Our low tonight, 73, a mostly clear sky, winds light and variable, so the dry air helping us to cool pretty good tonight, but we warm up pretty quickly tomorrow and it will be a little more humid for the PM hours. 97 hour high, mostly sunny skies turning partly cloudy. A slight chance of a stray pop up shower tomorrow. Somewhat better rain chances on Thursday and then kind of pinpointing Friday and Saturday. Those two days for the best coverage of the rain in the wire grass, but it won't be as hot. It will be more humid, but high temps, lower 90s on Friday, middle 90s on Saturday, and then those typical pop up afternoon showers and storms for Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, high temperatures in the middle 90s, low temperatures really not fluctuating much after tonight, kind of holding around 76 every single morning. So very typical weather is on the way. It's a trade off because today has been really hot, but yeah. it hasn't been real humid. It was really nice. It was really nice. I mean, hot, but the air felt good. Yes, it now, was nice enough to get outside and enjoy. I mean, sure. like you said, hot, but not as humid, so I'll take it. Yeah, the trade off is now you know, lower temps going forward, but yeah. a little more mugginess. That rainfall too, yeah. it's got, it's always on the weekend always here recently. Weekend. And now the rain chances are bumped up even Saturday, 50%, yeah. but hey, we need the rainfall. So I'm not going to complain too much, but not really looking forward we'll to that. We'll break that pattern at some point. I Maybe hope the so. the fall will be really nice we, for the high school games have, and the college games. We have to games. hope so. Yeah, yes. let's hope for that. Thanks so much, yeah. David.